Hello guys, this is Jose Butron riding for KTM Silveration and welcome to my home GP, Talavera de la Reina, Spain. Hey guys, this is Rui Gonzalez here. We are at GP of Spain, Talavera de la Reina. See you on track. A nice long start straight here at Talavera, wide as well. Pretty tight though, through turns one and two. The right, then the left, hard and slick underneath. Gonna be interesting through there in the main race on Sunday. Turn three, we press right, head uphill, a short, sharp climb into turn four, jumping through there, and dropping downhill slightly before a long incline up into turn five. Again, dropping on the exit, back down into a shallow valley, up into turn six. Climbing slightly here through turn seven, again, falling away as the riders go right, dropping back down in the valley in the opposite direction. The old track used to continue going off to the right, but we cut through short here this time around and just the two drop-offs heading downhill into the bottom end of the circuit. Nice and fast through this right hander. That will open up onto this flat part of the straight under the Monster Energy Bridge. Look at the difference between light and shade. Going to be a few braking bumps catching out riders there. Into turn 11, heading back uphill here into this left hander. And then dropping down through the fast sweeping left hander that is turn 12. And probably the fastest part of the racetrack apart from the start straight. Series of tabletops, 22, 23, and 25 meters long. The last one underneath the Ipone banner there in the background, landing hard on the brakes to make the left hand 180 degree turn. There is a berm around the outside that the riders can rail. But either way, we start to head back uphill through this right hander, continuing to climb, turning here before dropping off the edge of the world, a step down back into this tight left-hander over Scrub Hill under the Monster Energy banner. A long plateau dropping slightly downhill and then you have to straighten up here because we have a double jump on the corner. Then we have a series of twisty turns. First through a right, then a left. Then back through this right-hander, heading back uphill. A short burst over the summit. Used to be a lot steeper on the downside, but the tunnel access now underneath there means it's a lot shallower. The riders can jump a lot further. Monster Energy finish line jump awaits. But then on the landing, the riders flick through this left-hand turn under the bridge crossing, jump back onto the start-finish straight and pass pit lane to complete the lap. Mm -hmm.